Okay, I'm going to show you how to upload files that you've captured on your video camera. I'm using a Canon camera. I've done this also with Sony. If yours is a little bit different, you can give it a try. It, it should be pretty similar. The first thing I do is we open it. We've got a folder private. What we're looking for is the AVCHD. This is a format that I learned a couple years ago that you can upload these AVCHD files directly to YouTube without having to convert them or do anything else, which is really handy. So if we click in here, we've got the BDMV, and then you're looking for the stream file, and they will have these .mts files. So what I do is I take this AVCHD file and I copy it onto my computer. I don't really trust the speed from the SD cards while it's trying to upload. And so here we're going to find this. We're going to go into these you can see I, I've just changed I need to change the way that views you can see that over here with the details so I go into my stream once again we have to change the view here to details and what I do is I rename these files and get them ready for uploading to YouTube this was a game that was played on Saturday March 29th and you can see it'll play it'll play these files so here we we're going to rename the files and what I will do is I put what that is and this isn't done by quarter or anything like that if you're trying to do quarters you have to hit the stop button if you're just letting it play the whole time and I actually hit stop at the half if you're just letting it play the whole time there's a file limit size you can see, I mean the file limit size and you can see that right here it will once you get to that kind of the magic number there of 18 or 19 minutes it pushes over into the next file so what I do is I name them like this. I say one of four um, Red Devils is the name of the team versus Wasatch. And then I put the date. And I do my date format like this. So that was 0319. The reason I do that is the files will line up. If they're all the same name and that's all you do in it will change by the dates. So this is the way I name the files and I just, you can select that now, control C, copy it. And you can see it changes where those are, but then you just keep track. So now this is two of four. And here is, so you can just paste and copy. This is three of four. This is four of four. So once you have the files renamed like this, then you open your YouTube. We're going to go upload. It says select files for upload. It says you can drag and drop. It, the drag and drop doesn't seem to work in all the browsers. So I'm going to go find where they are in there. My videos folder. Here's my AVCHD going to go down to the stream and here we go here we have our five files I mean our four files and then I just start uploading these and you can see that it's copied the name just like I had oh something I forgot to put in here was the score which was uh, and so as these files are uploading you can you can change the names before it starts to upload these will take this will take some time to upload you can see here and so and this is actually for me when I was filming I got there late so this is actually a partial game and so I should put that in there too so now, if you want to add information, tags, and things like this, I put, that's my daughter's name, I put that in there, I put uh, red, red devils, Utah, I put the, these tags in here. Uh, if you want to put descriptions, you have to type in all the tags. Every time you hit the comma, it puts the new tags in their page gardener you can save it as unlisted or private right here you can make all these changes 
says also share on Google+. Plus. If you're coming on here and the interface looks a little bit different than it does right now, it's because Google has changed something. So that's for future. I filmed this on April 1st, 2014. So this should be consistent, but Google does change their interface quite often. So, and then you just wait for these to upload. Make sure to make all your changes if you want to do descriptions. All those you can uh, paste and copy these or any other description you want to add in there. This is something that's new. I'm just going to publish these as soon as they're uploaded. That's as easy as it is to upload those AVCHD files or the .mts files onto YouTube.